How YOLO works for object detection. Hi, everybody. If you're looking to become a full-time data scientist and artificial intelligence AI expert from scratch, then you are at the right place. Today, I'll explain how the object detection algorithm works in YOLO. Let's have a look at the introduction to YOLO algorithm for object detection. YOLO is an algorithm that uses neural networks to provide real-time object detection. This algorithm is popular because of its speed and accuracy. It has been used in various applications to detect traffic signals, people, parking meters, animals and so on. You're wondering what object detection is? Object detection is a phenomenon in computer vision that involves the detection of various objects in digital images or videos. Some of the objects detected include people, cars, chairs, stones, buildings, and animals. This phenomenon seeks to answer two basic questions. What is the object? This question seeks to identify the object in a specific image. Where is it? This question seeks to establish the exact location of the object within the image. Object detection consists of various approaches such as fast RCNN, retina net, and single-shot multibox detector, SSD. Although these approaches have solved the challenges of data limitation and modeling in object detection, they are not able to detect objects in a single algorithm run. YOLO algorithm has gained popularity because of its superior performance over the aforementioned object detection techniques. What actually YOLO is? YOLO is an abbreviation for the term you only look once. This is an algorithm that detects and recognizes various objects in a picture in real time. Object detection in YOLO is done as a regression problem and provides the class probabilities of the detected images. YOLO algorithm employs convolutional neural networks, CNN, to detect objects in real time. As the name suggests, the algorithm requires only a single forward propagation through a neural network to detect objects. This means that prediction in the entire image is done in a single algorithm run. The CNN is used to predict various class probabilities and bounding boxes simultaneously. The YOLO algorithm consists of various variants. Some of the common ones include Tiny YOLO and YOLO, version 3. Seeking why the YOLO algorithm is important? YOLO algorithm is important because of the following reasons. Speed. This algorithm improves the speed of detection because it can predict objects in real time. High accuracy. YOLO is a predictive technique that provides accurate results with minimal background errors. Learning capabilities. The algorithm has excellent learning capabilities that enable it to learn the representations of objects and apply them in object detection. How the YOLO algorithm works. YOLO algorithm works using the following three techniques. Residual blocks. Bounding box regression. Intersection over union, IOU. First one is residual blocks. In residual blocks the image is divided into various grids. Each grid has a dimension of S into S. The following image shows how an input image is divided into grids. In the image above, there are many grid cells of equal dimension. Every grid cell will detect objects that appear within them. For example, if an object center appears within a certain grid cell, then this cell will be responsible for detecting it. Second is bounding box regression. A bounding box is an outline that highlights an object in an image. Every bounding box in the image consists of the following attributes. Width, height, class, for example, person, car, traffic light, etc. This is represented by the letter C bounding box center. The following image shows an example of a bounding box. The bounding box has been represented by a yellow outline. And finally the last one is intersection over union, IOU. Intersection over union, IOU, is a phenomenon in object detection that describes how boxes overlap. YOLO uses IOU to provide an output box that surrounds the objects perfectly. Each grid cell is responsible for predicting the bounding boxes and their confidence scores. The IOU is equal to 1 if the predicted bounding box is the same as the real box. This mechanism eliminates bounding boxes that are not equal to the real box. The following image provides a simple example of how IOU works. If you're interested in learning more about starting a machine learning and AI career, then be sure to check out our courses at the first link in the description. Subscribe and turn on notifications so you don't miss more videos helping you to start your data science and AI career and more. Check out this playlist of our data science and machine learning lessons and see you in the next video. Take care.